Grant Miller, welcome to Passionate Living. Today we have a very special episode from the rainforest of Costa Rica. We're going to meet Dr. Tom O'Brien, and he is going to share his passion for health and wellness with us. You are not going to want to miss this segment of Passionate Living. This is going to share some very vital, important information for your own personal health. Thanks so much for watching, and enjoy. So I am here today with a new friend who is absolutely amazing, and you are a wealth of information. What I learned from that, there's not much in medicine that's all or every, but this was every. Every person that had a reproductive system problem were eating foods that they didn't know were a problem causing inflammation. They didn't know that they had a problem with dairy. They didn't know that they had a problem with wheat or gluten because they don't feel sick after they eat it. Now we know the ratio is eight to one. For every one person that has gut symptoms with a problem with wheat or gluten, there are eight people that don't have gut symptoms. They feel fine when they eat wheat, but the next day they've got a migraine. Right. You always have to address food. So as soon as we came out in practice, we opened on Valentine's Day in 1980, and uh, we were always including foods as a part of the protocol that we would put together for whatever a person had. And that hasn't stopped in 40 years. That's great. It's still the same, because people don't get this. They don't, our doctors aren't taught this. It's my comment yeah. on traditional medical care, that they don't know this because they're not trained. They're trained to deal with the symptoms. The Dean of Medicine at Stanford, a few years ago, he was invited to give the commencement speech for Stanford Medical School. Right. And he said, you know, you are some of the very best trained physicians in the world. You're going out into the world better trained with the most technical information of any medical school in the world. We're very proud and we have to apologize to you because 78% of what's going to come into your office is not acute problems, it's chronic disease. And we have not trained you at all on chronic disease. Wow. We've trained you on dealing with acute problems like high blood pressure or high blood sugar. And what do you do to get the blood sugar down? That's the acute problem but that it has nothing to do with why do you have high blood sugar? But now you have to learn how do you identify where the inflammation's coming from? Is it gasoline or kerosene that's causing the inflammation, killing off cells, killing off cells, until eventually you've killed off so many cells, now that tissue can't function properly. Professor Alessio Fasano, mm -hmm. he wrote a paper uh, last year, and the title says it all. All disease begins in the leaky gut. The pathway to inflammation in your body goes through the gut. What do you do for psoriasis? You have to include fixing the gut. What do you do for Alzheimer's? You have to include fixing the gut. Thanks so much for watching Passionate Living today. I hope you enjoyed this very special episode with Tom O'Brien. Make sure to watch part two with Dr. Tom O'Brien. We host every Tuesday and Friday on YouTube, a new segment of our show. So also feel free to come to our website for full episodes of passionateliving.com. And please, if you like this segment, press the like button and follow us for future segments of Passionate Living. We hope this inspired you and brought a little bit more light to your day. And I look forward to seeing you soon.